When you're at hudking.com, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, click on the T to follow us on Twitter, or enter a street name or zip code in the search bar to see other HUD homes in your area. If you're watching this on YouTube, click on the subscribe button to be notified of new uploaded videos. We are here at 907 Cormorant. That's 907 Cormorant over in the Enclave at Lakeside Subdivision. This is a beautiful big four bedroom, two and a half bath home. Approximately 2478 square feet, built in 2007. This home has an exterior of brick and hardy plank siding, and it's currently under the HUD lottery program, meaning if you're a firefighter, a police officer, a teacher, or an EMT, you get to buy this home at a 50% discount. That is about 75, 78,000 underneath the list price, and that's incredible. We don't typically see these with that kind of savings, but if it does not sell to a good neighbor next door buyer, then it will open up to the general public. This home sits on about an 8,500 square foot lot and exterior wise is in really good condition. Let's take a look at the backyard and then we'll look at the inside. Well, as we step out into the backyard, you can see it's a rather deep and long yard. And the neat thing is there aren't any neighbors currently behind the home, so you will have a little privacy there. This is a nice lot, really good sized lot. Exterior wise, like I said, hardy planks, very low maintenance and durable. You don't really need to do anything to the exterior. Pretty much move in condition. Oh, you know what? I do see a little bit of damage up there. So let me just zoom in up there. You see there's a tiny bit of cracking under the soffit there. So you'll definitely want to look at that. It's very, very minor. Considering if you buy this as a good neighbor next door buyer, you get it for about $78,000 off the list price. So I think there's room to work it. Let's look at the inside. Well, as we step into the home, the entryway does have ceramic tile. It's a decent tile, can probably be salvaged. Now, when we walk in, if we turn to the right, we are into your kitchen. Kitchen also has a dining area up front, or some people call it a breakfast area. It's typically where most of your dining will take place. Kitchen really just needs a fresh coat of paint. So we continue over and right to the left of the, uh, the entryway, we have a little storage closet. Then this opens up into your main dining room right up front. Now obviously this room will need a fresh coat of paint and flooring. We then have your family room here. Same thing, needs a fresh coat of paint, needs a little bit of flooring. Now one perk is that bedroom number one, the master bedroom and master bathroom are downstairs on the lower level. This room will need some flooring and will need some painting. Master bathroom here has a separate huge garden tub as well as a shower, so you can either take a shower or use the tub. It does have dual vanities. It's a nice vanity there with some cabinetry. Your commode and then your walk-in closet. So here's the walk-in closet. Pretty standard, some built-in shelving there. Master bathroom floor has tack-down linoleum tile. It does look like ceramic, but it's not. I would suggest carpeting or reflooring re the whole lower level. Next to the master, we have a half bath, which is a commode and a single vanity. Needs a fresh coat of paint. They never finished painting that. You do have an indoor laundry room. So your washer and dryer connections are going to be here inside, which is a perk. And then we have your standard two-car garage. It's a little dark in there, but it is a standard two-car garage. Obviously, it's been finished out. Other three bedrooms are going to be upstairs. Now, the carpet is dirty. We're definitely going to want to put new flooring in and new paint and a tiny bit of sheetrock work. So when we get upstairs, we have a very large upstairs second living area. You can see how bright and light it is with all of these windows. It's not lots of natural lighting. The far end, we have bedroom number two. Really good sized bedroom. It's gonna need some flooring and some painting. And it appears that there's a small leak up there. So you may wanna get that small leak addressed in the attic. I'm willing to bet it is conversation from the HVAC pan. Next to that, we have bedroom number three. Bedroom number three needs a little bit of flooring and needs some painting. Next to that, we have full bath number two. It's a single vanity, shower and tub combo. Needs to be regrouted, and I would suggest painting it and replacing the flooring. And then bedroom number four. All the bedrooms are really good size in this home, which is very nice. This room, I mean, the flooring is actually in decent condition. You might be able to salvage the carpet in here, and the paint's not in bad shape either. But to be consistent, I would probably just say paint the whole house, put new flooring in especially when you're gonna save about $70,000 on the price of the home. Let me give you a summary.
There it is guys, 907 Cormorant. That's 907 Cormorant. A beautiful big four bedroom, two and a half bath home. Yes, it needs carpeting. Yes, it needs flooring, but that's all pretty minor stuff. Plus you get to customize it the way that you like it when you buy it. Currently, this home is listed under the HUD Good Neighbor Next Door Lottery Program, meaning if you're a police officer, a firefighter, an EMT, or a teacher, you get 50% off of the price. The list price of this home right now is only $157,000. That means your Good Neighbor Next Door price is only $78,500. Now, there are some other minor fees that get rolled into that, so you end up getting the home for about $87,000, but that's still a huge amount of savings. So if it does not sell to a good neighbor next door buyer, then the home will open up to the general public at the list price of 157. So if you're interested in this home and you don't have a realtor, I'd love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan, I am the HUD King and I wanna help you find your castle.